Good morning guys and welcome to today. Today I'm gonna have a shower. So this is the before the shower. Um, it's like literally 11, almost 12. Yeah, well I'm having a shower later in the day. This is um, Librarian Gabby and she wanted to show you, actually I asked her to show you guys. This is what they did at horse camp. It's so cute. This is Sophie's. This is Sophie's. So they basically got all these branches and cardboard and they used hairspray. And yeah, it's like, so that's his lead glue. rope. Yeah. And so you can hang this up, right? It smells like tree branches. Yeah. And you can hang it on your wall. Some people use it and put ropes or elastic and put their ribbons on them. Some people hang them on their front door. Where's yours? Oh, that would be cute just to hang ribbons here. And here. Yeah. I like them. Where's yours? In the car. In the car. Where? Yeah, everything is in the car. That's why our car is so messy. Where's Polly? Look, he has a 17 What's his, horse. his name is Polly? You have your own horses, amazing horses, and you name it Polly. Yeah, because I. Beep, beep, beep. I always have a riding on horses whenever I want, but I. Anyway, yeah, we were supposed to have riding lessons. We were supposed to have riding lessons today with Fiona at our barn, but there's um, a family emergency at the barn. It doesn't happen very often, but when it does, you understand that it's just like just let them have their own time like i don't want to stress anybody out by going there even though it's a business and we pay to have our horses there imagine having like things going on in your own life and then having people just showing up all the time i don't want to be that girl don't want to be that girl okay do you want to be so that girl? i have this marinful do you want to be that girl what? she's like i don't even know what you're talking about so okay. i have this marinful oh I have the stallion to her, but I don't know where he is. Wow, she is cute. Is she actually a uh, Schleich? Briar. Oh, These are she's, all briars. They're all briars? You bought briars yesterday? You are a traitor. I have this, man. I did not know you were buying briars. I should have known. They feel totally different. Way cheaper. Cute, though. That's and then, Stella. And then, and then Chino. Chino. If you guys... If you guys don't know, uh, Gabby got her new horse yesterday. Before we bought him, I made it so super clear about what we wanted. We wanted, like, especially Sam, we wanted a maid in the shade horse. And a lot of you guys, are, or some of you guys, are like, what the heck? Ruby, life is fine. I'm fine. Every time I sit down, the horses, the dogs come to me. Every single time. Not that anyway, I wanted to share with you guys what somebody, I wanted to share with you guys what somebody sent me. Okay, so this is what somebody sent to us yesterday, but before I start, I should let you guys know I'm wearing the necklace that L.E.T. sent me, and then I'm wearing my prayer shawl that somebody else sent to me. It keeps me warm. It feels like a hug, a hug from Stella. I wish I knew who actually sent it. Because I wish I, I knew. Yeah, I would love to thank that person, to be honest. I love the colors. Did she not put her name in? She did. I thought it was Amy. Ew! What the heck was that? That's the first time Ruby's ever done that to me. No, I'm disgusted. Thing. Picture up. Okay, just wait. I'm gonna read it to you. So it's from April Dreams PH, but you know how sometimes the name is so long and you can't see the the last word, and then I saved it like that, so I don't know. April Dreams PH something. But anyway, she said, "Love him. It's awesome that you guys can see the his potential." It breaks my heart that so many horses are overlooked if they are underweight, under-muscled. Those end up being some of the best horses. Great job, Gabby, and I'm so happy for you all. Like, that's so nice. Thank you, April. <laughs> like, that is such a good point I want to point out. Like, we got a lot of stress from people, like a lot of high pressure. Like, don't buy him. Don't buy him. Like, behind the scenes, stuff that you guys don't see. Like, emails and messages and stuff of people saying, like, he does, he's not worth anything. And for, I think a lot of the time in our budget and where P and in the the area that we live in it is it's really important to be able to see potential not just what the what the horse has right then and I think that's like a big huge life learning lesson too that just because somebody doesn't look the way you think they are doesn't mean they are the way that you think they are if that makes sense like people will surprise you people are amazing if you give them a chance most people are amazing Ow. if you give them a chance. No. Right, Cookie? I <laughs> Did you hear Gabby? Gabby said, ha ha, not me. She's like, not oh. Nice. <laughs> she's like, oh, I am amazing. And she's she, not nice. She is nice, but she's sassy. Like, she's at that age right now where she is feeling her own oats and feeling like she's the queen of the world. Are you feeling like you're the queen of the world? No, because I still can't talk to people. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Yes. I can't even talk to myself with that. <laughs> it's true. I don't know. That's not. That's her dad. 
So her dad, you guys know her dad, know Sam. When we go out places, he doesn't ever say a word. Like, he just stands there and it's because he, I don't know. But Gabby gets that from him. But when we go places, somebody, like, what did that guy ask you yesterday? What color of bucket do you want? No, no, no. Like, he asked us. Yeah. Um, he said, what color again? And I was like, uh, yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> I tried to rush to say the word. Yeah. And I just mess up. Yeah. The camera went blurry. Oh, she was felt. too embarrassed. <laughs> she felt so, I got like all the puppies. She felt so much pressure from having him ask her the question that she didn't know how to say orange. <laughs> And, and she did do that and I'm like orange and he's like okay and he gives us the orange one and she's like see that's why I'll never get married no no I said see that's why I can't talk to people yeah but I mean if she knows you she can talk guys and that's when you wish that she couldn't talk every I single time you, I guys. sit down I get trampled by <laughs> who Ruby and Gabby yeah um no she pushed Ruby. me <laughs> there's a whole lot of silly going on in this house Ruby! I can't breathe! Oh! Alright, recess is over! Ah! Get her, Ruby! No! Rub, get her off the couch! Get her, get her Ruby! <laughs> It's the day before the ice storm is supposed to arrive and it is pure mud. It's gonna be pure. All the school buses got canceled and I have no idea why. Hello babies, you hungry for lunch? It is super mild out today. Super mild. Look at my hair. Anyway, um, Every day I go to the bar and I come back with a bag full of bags for grain. I like, I'm done with grain. <laughs> That's the worst part about having our horses out someplace else. But the best part about having our horses is I, I'm happy there. Are you happy? To do chores. Are you happy having your horses there? Yes. Not oh, wait. To do chores there. Yeah, not having to do chores. Lazy girls. Lazy. Oh, you left the door open. Oh, yeah. And she did. Oh, man. Oh my gosh! <laughs> nice job, scared the ponies. Is it funny that our horses are kissing horses? Like, is that a thing? Is that an actual thing? I gotta clean the poop out here. Kissing. Oh, poor Gracie. I just feel so bad that she's always Gracie's, at the back. Gracie was extra spooky this morning. Was she? Right. Oh, so close. She likes me. She's afraid of you. Oh, she's not scared of me. She is scared of you. No, she's not. I think she is. <laughs> she knows that you push her away. And even though you're trying to teach her respect, I feel like there's a better oh, no. way to do it. Hey! <laughs> why am I in no. <laughs> Why are you in there? Oh, dear. Here it goes. Here it goes. Here it's happening. You guys, my kids are, are, are always crazy. Because I call her brown ears. Oh yeah, that's why she loves you. Brown ears. Hey, brown ears. My oh, kids are usually cra ears. not so crazy Stella when the camera is not brown on. Ears. Stella was hippo. You're supposed to close that. See, she's always ready for you to push her off. Mom, she's she forgiving. Has no Gracie has no one to love. Yes. Yes. Excuse you. Hi, Gracie girl. She won't come here because Sky is mean to her. Yeah, Gabby, that's exactly what I wanted you to do. Well, it's either her bite and then Gracie squeal and kick and I'm in the middle of it all, or Abby. I make them all run away. Yeah, I don't believe in that. That's the thing, like, like there's some big discrepancy that I keep trying to explain and trying to figure out, like between the way that people say you need to be in charge of your horse and all the things, Gabby just wrangled Gabby Willow. <laughs> That's a tricker. She right bent down and pretended that she was gonna kiss Willow and then grabbed her. Yeah, like there I think basically this I figured it out last night what I was trying to say. But basically I feel like people feel that teaching your horse to be respectful is the same as 
teaching your horse love, like loving your horse. And yeah, you have to have an element of respect, otherwise you're gonna get killed because horses are big and powerful. But some of them are big. This one's not. Yeah, some are big. That one is not. But but yeah, I think that they're I think as a as a as a community, as a horse community, we have like a lot more to learn about respect and love because I think you can have respect with love but I don't think that respect naturally has love I think you need both so yeah that's my spiel you guys that's what I've been trying to figure out all right let's get to work let's get to work so here we go again it's no surprise because we know better than to all the day love and try to make it new you can fight it when it feels so true feels so true you turn me crazy like no one else the final moment before i lose myself and it's no use working nine to five if you want more than back it up missy Love is making sure that your horses can eat because if you just throw the hay out there somewhere, if you throw the hay and the horse on the low end of the totem pole has to pass the big horse to get the hay, it's not going to work out. I can. T <laughs> That's an interesting pose. Don't come to us. Pretty girl. Um, so yeah, we try and throw our hay so that everybody can get to it. I feel like uh, this girl's lost a little bit of weight, which is a good thing. But I feel like it's not very ha friendly. Willow's eating it all. You think Willow's eating it all? Willow's chunky. Willow's chunky? All right. Get to work, girls. Just stay alive. up and then I wish you just gone back to bed like please God take me back take me away take me back to bed well basically that's the kind of day this has been I have just I don't know like some days just really get to you so uh, one great thing that happened today was this brand new camera that we have brand new camera um, fell it fell got dented and now the lens won't close it's a common problem when you drop a camera it basically renders it completely useless destroyed can't use it less than two weeks we've had this camera i just want to cry like i've done it before i had it on my lap in a car and got out to stand up because i was in a hurry and dropped it on the ground and it got destroyed it wasn't as it was worse than this so maybe sam will be able to fix it i feel like he's not going to be able to fix it so I'm waiting for him to come home. He always has like, he's my knight in shining armor. He always saves every problem. Like no matter what happens, he always fixes it. So it was the girls this time. Sophie and Gabby accidentally dropped it on the ground and it broke. And yeah, so that happened. We are back in business, you guys. It is not the end of the vlog. Hey, yeah, that's a good title. It was about to be called the end of the vlog because yeah. <sighs> I'm not gonna lie, when the camera got broken, I was so frustrated and so upset because it was just over stupid stuff. And I got mad at the girls. I was like, Sophia, you need to start being more careful. And then she was crying and Gabby said that when I was getting mad at Sophia, she was over in her stall like, ha ha, Sophia's in trouble. And then I got Gabby in trouble too. And then she's like, ah, oh, because 
It hurts their heart. It hurts your heart when you get in trouble. One thing about me though is that I do get upset quickly. I don't get upset quickly, but when I do get upset, I get upset, but then once everything's all calmed down, I'm able to apologize and, and, and say, you know, all the right things. Like I did say, you know, it's only a camera. Who cares about the camera? Even though I spent almost a thousand dollars on it. Oh, it's so frustrating. Um, but yeah, and we should all remember that things are just things and people are people and I want my kids not to be damaged. <laughs> I want them to grow up and know that they're loved and that everybody makes mistakes and we all have accidents even <laughs> when, I mean, most of the time accidents are caused by dumb things. So yeah, anyway, that's my spiel about that. But Sam came home, I told you guys, he always fixes everything for me. Although he did not, was not able to fix the last time that happened but the camera was already a year old. This camera's two weeks old. So he said, he came home and he said, do you want the good news or the bad news? And I'm like, I want the, I want the good news. And he said, I fixed the camera, but then he broke it again. So basically, you know, the little screen cover that protects the screen, broken, but the camera's usable again. And so I'm just so grateful that you guys are not gonna have to listen to that awful zoom in motor until I get a new one. So thank you, Sam. <laughs> anyway, we're headed into town. We're gonna do a little bit of shopping because I'm going to my first girls' night in, I don't know, 22 years? I think it's, no, not 22 years, maybe 10 years? 10 years, my first girls' night. Usually I get invited and I am too tired because I we always, like, I work at night. We we edit at night and it might not seem like a lot to you, but to get our videos out, it it's a lot of work. It's a lot of editing. We sit down at night and we go for about four, maybe five, sometimes six, depends on how long it takes us, that many hours. I'm super grateful to be able to do that because my kids are there playing their games with their friends online and Sam and I are there, we're together as a group and it's not like a job where you have to leave them and stuff. So I'm glad, but it does make me so that I can't go out to girls night. So tonight I'm breaking free and I'm going out to a girls night. How do you feel about the girls night? I said that either my family is gonna be like, oh no, my mom is gone and feel lost and alone or they're gonna be like, yes! Which one, night. which one is it? It's a party night. Yes, yes she's gone. <laughs> yeah, I'm the slave driver in our house, you guys. Somebody's gotta be the bad guy, and it's me. So, yeah. Come fly with me, just take my hand. And now that we are cruising in the cloud, you better watch out for the crib tonight. So come on over, we can make it through. excited and I'm excited to like do my hair and get changed and not smell like horses so that means gonna mean change my purse because all my purses smell like horses so I'm gonna take this little horse cute horse blue one but it's got some mud on it hopefully it's not horse mud if you know what I mean <laughs> I'm sorry this vlog is kind of not got much in it it's just kind of a crazy day it was one of those kind of days so we're gonna end today's video by shouting out people Gabby's suggestion. You guys think she doesn't love you. You guys think that she's snotty. You guys think that she doesn't get it, but she does. She's just experimenting with who she is right now. This is one that I follow. Oh, on Instagram. So Instagram. Instagram so who is it? Day by day vlog. Day okay, by day vlogs fan page. I have some problems. She has some problems because you guys. On day by day underscore vlogs underscore day day, fan. Day by day underscore vlogs underscore fan has Sophie and Finn with red hearts and Gabby and Storm with orange. Orange hearts. But you know what? That's a sign. Because what color is your new boy? Orange. Yeah, maybe this is a sign. And then she updated it so it says Laura and Rip Stella. Yeah, poor Laura and Stella. And it's yellow hearts. Aw. So what? I got yellow hearts! Stella's color was mostly yellow too. No! When I owned Stella's her, color be pink, you guys! <laughs> just joking. I just love any kind of hearts. Alright, who okay. else are we shutting out? Oh, she made the llama. Uh -oh. Wait, wait. A llama fan. Wait, there's one of Sophia falling off and him going, ugh. Wait. It's right there. 
Knees to nose videography. That's what it says. Knees dot says two dot nose underscore videography. What do you like about her? Oh, I like that she made an edit about me. <laughs> oh, you've been looking cute. That was me when I wore a helmet. <laughs> you always wear a helmet, sister. No, a hairnet, I meant to say. Oh, okay. That's why so I can't talk. And spurs. All right, so are you ready for anybody else? Uh, I swear she doesn't just sit around looking at edits of herself on Instagram. Although we- Day I, by day vlog, dog, <laughs> vlogs, underscore edits. Day by day dot vlogs, underscore edits. See, what do you, I can't talk. What do you like about her account? She made it Storm and Gabby's iconic moments. Oh, that's cool. Uh. Yeah, you had a lot of iconic moments in the last two years. Like he jumped the tires. Have, how long have you owned him? Two years? Yep, two Almost years. Almost two years. Almost two years. Um. Parents, don't buy your kids a horse. They don't last long. Don't buy them a lazy one. Buy them, buy them one that they have to grow into. And then sell it and buy a different one. But you had to grow into Storm. Yeah, but he was kind of slow. So buy a forward one that you can... That even too. that even if you yeah even happy if happy forward one not the one who says I'm gonna kill you. Okay, so last one because I gotta edit before I can go to this okay. party. Flying horse videography. I just learned how to say videography. I just learned how to read that word because I used to say something else like video. Graphy. Yeah. Yeah. Same. Graphery. Yeah. Same. Like, so flying horse. Wait, that's the second here. Let's see if we can get it. Get it. Get it. Hold on. Flying horse go. video. Flying horse videography. And and why do you like them, Gabby? She she made an edit of True Love and Gabby and her handsome horse storm. See me stuttering? Do you only like accounts that make edits of you? Mostly. <laughs> She's just and kidding. Vinny. Yeah. And Chino. Yeah. There already is one up. That I didn't get tagged in it. I know. I... Oh, I like this one though. X day by day dot edits X. X day by day edits X. But that's like the picture I posted. So she still reposted and tagged it. I went on Instagram while they were doing work and um, I saw, oh, there's already an edit of Chino. And then she went on her phone and she's like, I didn't get tagged. <laughs> she's freaking out. But anyway. I didn't get tagged. Yeah, I'm... she may be a little self-centered. I'll be working on that. I'm mad about that. <laughs> anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll be back tomorrow. Tomorrow's the day that the storm is supposed to start. So we are going to go to the barn, take care of our boys, and we're going to put them all together tomorrow and see how it goes. So anyway, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Thank you.